Bible story. Today's the Bible title is Let My People Go. The Plagus and the Passover. Exodus 7, 14 to 12 and 32. Moses and Aaron told Paro, the God of the Israel, said, You must let his people go free. Otherwise, bad thing will happen to you. But Paro would not listen. So, Paro used Israel people as a slave and Moses was going to has gone to Paro to tell let the people of Israel the people of the God but still Paro so Moses said if you will not you will have it the bad things ha will happen, but still Paro would not listen. So God turned the water in Egypt into blood. No one could drink it. Then he filled the Egyptian house with frogs. Frogs were everywhere. Still Paro would not listen. So <coughs> the bad thing. The first bad thing was the in Egypt the longest Okay, so God turned the water in Egypt into blood so no one can drink and second was in Egyptian houses there were so many frogs and the frogs were everywhere you can see the blood oh the frogs are so many there's so many frogs I really don't like frogs God filled the skies of Egypt with gangs. They covered the people like dust. Then he struck the land of Egypt with flies. Still, Paro would not listen. So, even there were many frogs, still, Paro did not listen. So, one more time. So, God filled the skies of Egypt with gods. They covered the people. Mm, I really don't like. And second time, and third time, also Paro would not listen. So, God. So in Egypt, the, then he struck the land of Egypt with flies. Mm. Uh. Question, Paro let God's people go after all the water in Egypt turned it to blood. No, false. So God killed the animals of Egypt, horse, horses and donkeys, camels and sheep, cows and goats all died. Then he covered the Egyptian people with Soros. Still, Pharaoh would not listen. So. So 
God killed the all animals of Egypt. But still, Paro would not listen. So, God covered the Egyptian people with sources. Sources. See, all the people. Oh, I don't want to see. And hills to crush the crops of Egypt. Their barley and flax were destroyed. Then he sent Lucas to eat what fruit remained. Still, Paro would not listen. So, Got sent hills and still Paro would not listen. So God also sent Lockes to eat the thing, the left thing. <coughs> They're eating the food. So God sent darkness over the land. But again, Pharaoh would not listen. God said, I will kill every firstborn son in Egypt and all the firstborn of the animals. So Pharaoh was not listening, kept not listening. And God sent darkness over the land again. Over the line, line, land. <laughs> but again, Paro would not listen. So at the ten, that thing was every firstborn son, son in Egypt, and all the firstborn and animal will die. <gasps> Question, what happened that, to the Egyptian the first time Pharaoh would not let the Israel go? Number three, right? <coughs> My people must kill a lamb, eat it, and put its blood on the doorpost. I will see the blood and pass over their house. Those children will not die. So God said to the Israel people, kill a lamb and paint the lamb blood on the door paste. You can you will call this Passover and always remember it. The Israel obeyed God, but the Egyptian firstborn son died. Even Pharaoh's son finally Pharaoh would listen. He let the Israel go. So the ten bad things happened. And so now Paro let the Israel people go. Also, Paro's son died, right? Question, bad thing happened to Egypt because Paro would not let God's people go. True. Yes. The song, the fruit of the spirit.
love, joy, peace, patience, kind. Oh, sorry, I will do it again. Love, joy, peace, pa patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, and self-control. Yes, today I read the Bible story. Did you enjoy? I really enjoyed it. But we should obey God, right? That list. Let's see you next time. Bye.